Hi guys, welcome back to the Do It Yourself YouTube channel. Today we've got a nice quick and easy job for you. If you're watching this, I'm assuming you're having some problems sealing up one of these 32 mil or inch and a quarter uh, basin wastes. Some of these can persistently leak. And today I'm gonna to show you just how to seal it up the easy way rather than messing around with silicon and uh, PTFE tape and taking it on and off and swearing lots of times. So I'll assume that you've tried all them other things already and it's still leaking. Just a quick note, um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. There's loads of DIY stuff coming up, tool reviews, um, plumbing, electrical, all kinds of tips and tricks. So yeah, hit the subscribe and the like button if you can for me. Um, and let's make a start. So the reason these leak often is the water runs down the threads and or the water's passing through this O-ring. There's a little O-ring here, but some of these sinks haven't got a perfectly flat finish on the bottom of them and the water can just seep past it. So I'm gonna show you a way to deal with either of those problems and stop this from leaking. First thing we need to do, grab yourself a pair of pliers. I've already loosened this one off. Just take the nut off the bottom and the seal. Let me just take this basin waste out. And what you will, however, need is the O-ring on the bottom of this piece here. Place your waste back in, position it, clean up any silicon or anything on the bottom here and take off any PTFE tape if there's been any applied before. What we'll do next is grab one of these. I call these magic seal kits, but um, I think they're called Thomas Dudley Basin Waste Seals or something like that. There's a few, I'll stick a link in the description where you can grab yourself one. Basically what this does is it, it creates a really good seal on the bottom of the sink unit and um, this threaded area inside here creates a good seal as well around the threads on the on the basin waste and then this collar obviously tightens it all up and keeps it in place but it creates such a good seal it really is a magic seal kit so I'll show you how to apply this you don't need any silicon or anything like that all you need to do is hold your basin waste at the top put this on it can be a bit tricky just center it up, grab your foam washer, put that over. Next you want to put this white collar on and then your nut. And then we just need to nip it all up. Now it will find its own center, you just need to help get it started. Do this up. And I just nip them up with a pair of pliers, you don't need to go mad. Once you've got that nice and tight, just reattach your trap. Obviously, that will vary depending on what sort of trap you've got. In this case, it's a furniture waste. Right, that's all back together, we'll give this a test now. Right, moment of truth, let's give this a test now. Right, there we go, that is all sealed up. That leaked like a sieve before, shows just how good these seal kits are. Like I say, links in the description. Go grab yourself one if you've got a leaky basin, that'll, that'll seal pretty much anything up. So yeah, smash the like and subscribe button. I'm hoping that this has saved you guys a bit of a headache. Um, and I'll see you in the next one.